Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome to the first episode of Hack and Slash. Uh, this game is a, uh, what's a 2.5D maybe? Kind of a top-down, third-person sort of walk-around Hack and Slash game with a little twist to it. Um, the, the twist is that instead of killing things, you hack them. And by hack them, it means you actually change the way they're programmed. Pretty cool game, good concept behind it. Another uh, game by Double Fine Studios. If you guys are acquainted with their work, they do a very good job. The game is in early access right now, it's on Steam. Um, overall, they're putting it on Steam to make it so the community, they say that they're making it so the community will help them guide how they want the game to play. That's the way early access games, to me, should be completed. Anyway, uh, we're going to start a new character. <laughs> yeah, Blitz. We're going to do Blitz LP instead of Blitz. Blitz. Yeah, we'll just do Blitz LP. That'll work. And the other ones I've been practicing, uh, just trying to get a little interest in the game. Oh, Act 2 in which I meet a new friend and start an adventure. All right, here we go. So this is kind of the art style of the game. Kind of a, the painting sort of look. Phew, that fall could have hurt. To advance conversation, hit space bar. Doink, doink, doink. It did hurt. <laughs> yep, ow. All right. I'm glad I borrowed the sword. Maybe I can use it to bust out of here. Swing the sword of space. Slicey, slicey, slice. Uh, e, hit E on the door. It rattles. Locked. Maybe I can open it with the sword. Let's pry that bad boy open. Joink. Just kidding. Dun, 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 dun. Ah, did I break it? Was that part supposed to come off? It's a USB stick. So you get the, the feeling how the game goes. You swing your USB stick, and you can hack things by putting them on and off. Pretty cool idea. I have not seen a game do this before. There's a lot of things we're going to get into here in a little bit, too. I played the game a little bit, just like you saw, trying to get a feeling of it. Um, so this, basically it's a linear, it's kind of branching path, so you do get a little bit lost, a little bit mazed. has a very Zelda-esque sort of feel to it. Um, it, the original Zelda, like the NES, is basically the only one I've ever played. All right, hack block, remaining pushes. And I'm pointing with my finger. The mouse doesn't work. You can't see my mouse. Oh, you can. No. Yeah, it'll flash through a little bit, but you can't see it. Uh, remaining pushes, one. Seconds per push. Doesn't matter. Tiles per push, one. Time before pushing starts. You can actually delay everything. So you can plan out ahead. If I do that, it's going to take ten seconds. Four, five... Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Come on, don't call me a liar. There we go. Hey, down there, are you okay? <laughs> I got free. What is that thing? Oh, hi. <laughs> Be careful. That hole is tricky. <laughs> He's got a happy little face, doesn't he? Hey, you're a sprite, right? Uh, hey, uh, you're a human. A red human. Red? Oh, bites, we found each other. Bits. Oh, bits. Bits. Get it? Bits, because it's in a kind of hacky sort of bits computer world. Bit. Yeah. I'll be quiet. I think we're a match. Okay. Yeah, we're going to be best friends. Wow. Look at that. He is very excited. And uh, they're going to have the same voice, because that's going to be hard for me to remember. Oh, what's this dude? Wizard Zap. Eh? So this guy's got a little sprite thing too. Magic time, boom. This must be a wizard or something. Still, eh. The uh, fireballs, whoosh. Yeah, that was an entrance. All right, so we've just been introduced to maybe the main bad dude. Yeah, best friends River. Hey, wait, what's my name? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, come on! You bond with the sprite, you pick a name. You know the rules. Wait, what rules? Who made the rules? I don't know. They're just the rules. Look at this face. They do a good job with the animating, even though it's just a still. Hmm, what about... We call you Value Bob. He looks like a Bob. Bob! Bob! Awesome! Oh, yeah, yeah. Your name can be a Winless Reel. My name is Blitz, LP. Well, Blitz. My name is Blitz. Whoa, you can break the rules? Cool. Let's get out of here. I was bound, that was bound to draw some attention. All right. Yeah, let's go on an adventure. Look at his little face. He's so excited with his USB mouth. All right, don't wanna, I don't think I can fall down that hole. Nope. 
All right, continue on to the wild blue yonder. Oh, right. We are, we have gotten out of the cave. Oh, we can go back in it. And I think everything resets. Oh, let's just not try it. So it kind of has that feel of Zelda 2 when you go in and out of a room. Oh, you see the, it, you kind of go into, you saw the little bug flash there. And it kind of shows, it's kind of a cool idea. It looks like we have a ocean shore kind of on the edge of a biome, kind of switching into the more foresty biomes. And we get to the first obstacle here, we get to hack. Half block, first stationary, remaining push is one. Let's push it, I don't know, can we push it like five? Get it out of the way? Because we can't, if we push it one, it's going to stop right here. Yeah, that moved it out of the way. And a bush. These bushes are pretty cool. These bushes are health packs. And you set them on fire and you get the health out of them. Dinky doink. Check it out. So our health bars are full. There's a bunch more of these around. Uh, looks like another block here. We'll move this out of the way. One push. We'll move it three spaces and push it away. Ha ha ha. And we have a little placard here that we can't interact with. But we can interact with the chest. Do 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 do. An extra heart in here. I feel more hearty. <laughs> yeah, little pirate. And our little Bob is happy of us. Nice. And that's where we came out down there. So, get an idea where we are. Uh, I can't go up here, I don't think. Let's keep on moving uh, to the left first. Oh, hi. Hello. What is that? He flew away. Uh, I'm not going to explain what happens if you fall in this hole because if you fall in that hole you go back to the beginning cave and that's no fun you go left or right uh bad dude bad dude bad dude all right aggressive oh he took two hearts off of us aggressive false wait we're gonna keep him attacking but we're not gonna let him do any damage is that what happens oh he goes away let's heal up good job get the hearts me hearty Get me hearty. Oh, look at John. Hello. Bloop. Oh, I can't go in there. And another river. What do we have up here? Stop. Stop, gate. Can you do anything, Bob? Nope. Look at that. You can actually go behind it. That's kind of cool. The different layers on the screen. Yoink. Behind that. Oh, hello, turtles. Can I, can I get in here? Can I... Oh, I can push. What? Excuse me. Oh, can I just push these guys out of the way? Uh, no. Let's push this out of the way. Push that once. Um, hey, I can push that out of the way. I can. I didn't think that would be possible. We'll push it once again. Push it up. Come on. Es excuse me? One. Turtle. So, so a Koban puzzle right two. Okay, maybe it's not allowing me to push it. Uh, so if I push this top one, go on my way. Hmm, let's push this one. We'll push this twice. Push that out, and then we can sneak in behind him here. Yeah, yeah, yep, yep. E. Dude, dude, what's this thing? There is a weird, weird artifact thing. Yep, it's a Pokeball. I wonder what it does. It summons Charizard, except it's not really... Oh, look, a town. Alright. I guess we can continue to the right. Do, 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 do. And this is a bridge. Oh, another raven. Did he hit me? Aggressive false. Nope, he didn't hit me. Good. Another bridge? Nice. Where does this lead? I gotta do something with this. Hearts to drop. True. Burn, 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 burn. Ah. Okay, there's another bridge. <laughs> so many bridges. A little campfire? Cool, another health thing. Uh, this is where we started, isn't it? Yep, it is. Alright, that makes sense. Kind of looped around. There's a turtle. Can... Hey. Hello, turtle. Hi, I guess that... <laughs> I can walk on the turtle. Or float on the turtle. Can I go? Oh! Oh, that scared me. Yep. Riding the turtle. We rode him across. This is where we came out over here. Alright, there's where the chest was. That bridge goes around. So the turtle's a little locomotion. That's nice to have. 
Um, hmm, that's saying to go that way. I guess we'll go this way. Pshew. Oh, what is this? A big, a big room. Can I do anything here? It does not look like we can do anything here. Looks like this is a door, though. You see the zigzag pattern going up to the middle here? Maybe a little hard to see on the YouTubes. But I can't. I can't smack it at all. I guess we go back. Going back, going on back. Backing up, backing up, backing up, backing up. And back here. We go to the left. Everything reset now, didn't it? Hey, that might be a good way to clear puzzles. Huh. Oh, hi, buzzard. Oh, I hit him. Uh, aggressive false. Turn him off. And now we can... Can I do something else with you? Maybe not. Talk to the rock? <laughs> Thanks for getting rid of that raven. You're welcome, rock buddy. Yeah, good fighting that raven, Bob. Look at the smirk eyes. Blitz has got some smirky eyes going. You're welcome, Blitz. Oh, we probably want to get through here. Over the way. Yeah, Rocco, get out of my way, get out of my face. And uh, let's do damage per hit, and then let him be aggressive. <laughs> so he's gonna pester the rock for for eternity, <laughs> but never do any damage to him. <laughs> that was me. Uh, down, down. Okay, that's that bridge we passed over. Some more stuff here. Um, I always kind of like going to my left as I go to my right. Okay, we've been to that. All right. Uh, I think this is, yeah, this is where we came through. Okay, that leads to the bridge. Makes sense. And I guess we go through here. Hey, turtle. What's up, turtle? Oh, snap. Oh, belly. Get the belly. Tickle his belly. Uh, explode on charge, false faction. You see, you can change all of these things. That's a really cool thing. So you can change charge speed. So he actually moves slower during his charge than he does during his typical movement. Uh, damage. Damage would do zero, so he wouldn't do anything. Explode on charge, you can hit that false, you can turn them good, make them not hostile to you. Field view of angle, you can shut down how much, how far he views. Flipped over seconds, so he lays on his back forever. All sorts of cool stuff with this guy. He's not going to be mad at us, but he, his spikiness does continue to be spiky. Raining pushes, let's give us a couple, get this out of our way. Wonderful, and back up into here, this is where we go. Oh cool, we're in little green forest thing. Alright. Hey guys. I can't move. Oh. What's up dudes? Hey dude, where have you been all this time? Nowhere much. Just going on crazy adventures with my newly bonded human. Uh huh. Rad, none of us thought you'd find a human to bond with. What's that mean? Yep, pretty high standards. Had to find the right one. Yeah, and red spiders are super undesirable to most humans. Um... Did I say spiders? <laughs> oh no, did I pick wrong? What? No, oh, Bob, Bob's sad. You can't go wrong. It's just fate. Ah, good, I was worried. Oh, at least his teeth are clean. <laughs> it's rare, though. Humans just don't like to bond with red sprites. It's happened, like, twice. Who are the other red people? Who knows? Humans all look the same to us. <laughs> Actually, take this amulet so we can tell who you are. Please don't take it off. Yeah, man, that's a good one. We'll let you hop around in time space. Ooh, we can go back in time. Nice. Cool. So I use it like this. Two use equipable items. One, two, three, and four. Wait, don't go back yet. We have to... We'll have to have this whole conversation again. That's no fun. Ah, makes sense. I hope I haven't done that a bunch of times. <laughs> Humans, so silly, but great. Like when they get all cleaned up, that Toxic Waste, that stuff was a drag. Oh, great. What? No, Toxic Waste is still everywhere by that lab that blew up. It was just there. Meth lab? Everything was still there weird and bitey. Ugh. Really? Oh, no. But since you two are going on crazy adventures, maybe you could help us out. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Cleaning up a spill doesn't sound very adventurous. Okay, fine. We're on it. We'll figure it out. We'll do it. It'll be an adventure. So guys, I think uh, we're at like 15 minutes. Um, oops, we're going into the next zone. This is probably where I'm going to leave it, right here. Uh, we can hit the two, and you can actually see 
this is the the space-time thing. We can go all the way back, go back to the sprite clearing. I think it's sprite, it might be spirit, I'm not sure. Um, spooky path was the one, magic gate, all sorts of stuff. This will split off a little bit here. This is about as far as I've played too. I've wandered around a little bit in here and pretty much got lost and quit uh, to record. So guys, if you did enjoy this, um, let me know down below. Definitely do if you haven't already hit the like button. Uh, subscribe if you haven't. And I will probably be continuing this if you guys do like it. So if you did, please do let me know and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time.